I swear to God, if I didn't make this again, I'm gonna fail this video and make it tomorrow. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mosley and today I have a new video for you. So, um, last time I made this contact lenses video from TGDI.com and actually it turned out pretty great. Uh, by turning great, I mean I got over 20 views. So, yeah, it's very depressing that all my videos like only get 5 or 10 views at a time so 20 is big for me ironically it's big for me but I'm not failing it's a small channel I'm growing I'm growing so after that I didn't expect that video get so many views like honestly I thought it would be like the at like the other ones get only three views, seven views at the most, but that one got twenty. And luckily, I have already ordered during Thanksgiving. So with that being said, I didn't know I can make another video, but this time a lot better. Last time I had only one pair. This time we have three pair. So yeah, pretty great. So so I'm gonna put in the clip that I did unboxing like the last time. Um, I've I unboxed that pretty much a week ago, um, so I can't remember exactly what I said in the in the film because I haven't edited it yet. I'm I'm planning to put them all together. So if I haven't said it, I have to give you a feedback on the last pair of contacts since I told you I will give you an update. After the first time I wore them, it was so horrible. I took them out immediately after the filming and I feel really uncomfortable. The minute I took them out, my eyes were just like relieved. And I was just wondering like what's wrong with this whole website thing? Like the packaging just made me doubt about it. And like the, you know, the packaging, if I, you know, I did in the last video, it was they was like dented and everything was like in Chinese it's not made in Korea well it didn't promise it was made in Korea but like it says it was shipped from New York but actually the shipping address if I track the number is actually from China so I was confused the whole time I didn't know what to do but I was a pretty brave person so I tried it out but you shouldn't if um, if you haven't did uh, any kind of research on this and you see something really suspicious you shouldn't wear them you shouldn't put them in your eyes or any kind of your body parts because you know they, they might be hurting you and so I didn't thought about it I was really stupid I put them in and it turned out super horrible and the second time I was like you know what, maybe I should give it another shot. So the day I was filming it, the first day I was filming it, actually I didn't have much sleep. So I had only three hours sleep, so my eyes were pretty dry at a time. And I think that that might be one of the reasons. And the other reason is, during that day I've been wearing another pair of contact lenses for quite a few hours. So I feel like that might be another reason that why those felt very uncomfortable. It might be because my eyes were feeling really dry. And secondly, those pair of lenses, I soaked them only for one day, and it could be one of the reasons. So this time, I learned my lesson. I soaked everything for a whole week, and I checked on them, make sure they're fine. So now you're looking at, actually, one of the pair, one of the pair I'm wearing. So if you want to know which pair it is, you need to keep look at the clip right now. So I have protected my personal information on this. This is brand new. I have not opened this. I'm super excited. I literally just got it like three minutes ago. That's why I'm like naked face because I survived my finals today. I didn't want to, you know, waste any of my time on uh, doing makeup. But yeah, I ordered these during um, Black Friday because it was 50% um, off and it was like, Oh hell yeah! And the, like the Instagram picture they have are like just amazing. So I got this, and um, like the same, they gave me a whole bunch of exactly same contact lenses box. So we have seen that last time. I'm just gonna skip through that, and I don't. Wow, this time the packaging is different. This time they didn't, they didn't give me the mirror. They didn't give me the mirror. I wanted a mirror. I waited three weeks for this. They didn't give me the mirror. It's okay, I don't need it anyway. But, so these are what come in today. 
So, yeah, I'm still very salty about they don't put any information on their website. So, like, when you look at how big Eastern contact lenses and their curve, basic curve, they don't tell you anything. They tell you 8.5 to 8.7. So that's basically rubbish. They don't tell you anything if that's going to fit your eye or not. So I basically order them without knowing anything. And they tell you the diameter is going to be 14 to 14.5, which is basically every kind of contact lenses you could ever buy for daily uses. And that's not what I want because 14.5 is going to be looking huge in my eyes and I won't be able to fit them into my eyes because I will have like no white part on my eyes like when I when I like look at you like this this white part is gonna be covered up I don't want that happen but let's see what we get today so um still from the packaging it's just this mine soft hydro like contact lenses wannabe classic that's all it says in English and the basic curve, here it is. So if you want to buy this, you want to know this at first. This is, the basic curve is 8.5. So if you're like not able to wear that, don't buy it. And uh, what the hell is on my finger? And also it is 38% um, water in it. Um, so the moisturizer of it, they get the moist off it. And um, let's see, what else? Oh yeah, it's good until 20 wait it says it's made this year it says it's made this year in October wow these are fresh okay that's that's good news and also the diameter is 14 the basic curve is 8.5 so that's like very basic things you need to know before you buy any stuff so and I'm trying to like shake it into like the the juice so you can tell what it looks like this is what they look like I love this color. It looks so cute. It's like fairy tale kind of. I don't know. I like this color very much. And also, if you hear a little bit this kind of sound, it's because I have ladybugs and they're on my studio lights and I hate them. But um, I live in a dorm. They cannot do anything about it. So I'm real sorry about it. Um, and keep going for um, this. There's another same box. I'm going to just open this one. Um, it doesn't tell me what. It doesn't tell me what color it is, but so like you all have to like look 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 at the color of it. I'm just really hoping they can give me like a slip or anything. Just tell me which one is which. Ooh, okay. Um, the second pair is basically the same kind of information, so I'm just gonna skip over it. Um, yeah, although it's from the same company. It's from the same company, but their packaging is a little bit different. And this one is made in September. So you can tell these are different. And yeah, um, let me show you the color of this. I love this color. I don't know if you can tell. It's not clear. It's like whitish. And I think these are the great one. I want it. I bought a pair of gray one because like, they look super duper beautiful out of the packaging. I don't. I think this is the gray one. I'm so excited. And I'm going to put this aside. We have last pair. I think it's like each box, they come with one, but they're trying to fit, like, ship it, like, with less shipping cost. So, like, they put it, like, squish them into one package, because, like, this is, like, packed. And this is from We Dorothy Con. I don't, I don't know what it is. And it doesn't have much information on the box. It just see, it just says what, what website is it from. Okay. Oh, wow, this is also from, and... Okay, there it is. It's 8.6 curve. I like it. And it's 14.2. Ooh, 14.2. A slightly bigger than the usual one I want. I want 14. But this is okay. And a look at the back. I'm a little suspicious about these, but... These are what they look like. Ooh, 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 ooh. So beautiful. Okay. And um, now I'm just going to unpackaging all of these and put them into these little cases. Um, yeah, and after that, I will soak them in the solution, silent solution, for at least 8 hours. I think at least 8 hours. It depends on how long I sleep tonight. And we shall see you later. And you can see me try them on and it will be super exciting. Okay, see you later. Bye. 
Okay, so you're back. So just like in a video, if I have given you an update, the pair that I tried before, I tried a second time, it was actually very comfortable. I didn't feel weird at all. I didn't have any very painful eyes. I didn't get blurry or crying. So everything turns out fine. So I begin to have a little bit of trust. So this time, the curve is 8.5, and I was a little suspicious about it, and then the diameter was 14.2. Um, I think. So this time, the pair of lenses that come in was 8.4 for um, the basic curve, but actually, when I was diving about it, I didn't know it would fit in my eyes, but this time, it didn't hurt anything, it doesn't give me any uncomfortableness, so interestingly, I didn't feel weird. And now I'm gonna zoom in real quick, you're gonna look at my eyes, and how does it look like. So as you can see, this is very pretty, and I actually like how it looks. So as you can see this time, the actually, this contact lenses looks perfectly great on me, and I really like it, and um, I really like how it turns out like this. Um, since my lightning is not a perfect during all the kind of YouTube videos, um, I'm still working on it, trying to make it look a little bit brighter. Um, so you may not be able to see what it actually looks like during daylight. During daylight, they're perfectly beautiful. It just, it looks gorgeous. And now, um, I'm going to review which pair of it is. And this is actually from the pair that you see earlier in the video. It's the black, um, uh, black one. I put it into the box, and this is the... The box that I put it into so if you're interested in this one you know what it is but I um, unluckily when I was ordering it that didn't um, when I was ordering it I didn't get a account on the website so everything I ordered I cannot review back to it I can try to find it in my email but I'm not a hundred percent sure if I can still review it after the uh, product was delivered but still I'm gonna try and I'm gonna put um, the links down below. I'm not sponsoring anything. It's just if you're interested in it, you, if you like this contact lenses and you can take the risk that it may not fit you, um, you can go to the website and order them from the links. But I can't promise you because I really don't know if I can still review the product or not. So, I'm gonna keep going. Anyone you have watched the last video, you know I'm really, really bad at putting on contact lenses. That's why I don't have any nails right now. Um, so I, what I'm gonna do is I will put them put them on off camera because if I put them on camera, you probably won't be able to see me the whole time, um, and I really need to stand up instead of look down to put on Canon kind of lenses. So yeah, um, see you right back. Oh my God, I'm crying. The minute I opened this blue box, I was like. What the hell? Where did my contact lenses go? Did it melt? And then I realized oh, they were the white ones. I can't see them. So, can you see them at all? Because I cannot. If this is so hilarious. Okay, I'm going to be right back. Alright, I'm back. I put on the white pair. So I'm going to zoom in right now so you can see it. Alright, so, this pair, I put them, the, put them on, I also didn't feel any kind of uncomfortableness. Uncomfort I did have a little trouble, I need to remind you all, if you have any kind of vision problem, these pair of lenses may give you a little bit of trouble. So, when I was t taking them out of the box, so these cases, I can't find them. I have zero eyesight problems, I have perfect regions, I cannot see them. So I took one of them out and I was like, okay, this one on. And then when I re reached back for the second one, I put my whole finger into the case, I stirred, I felt nothing. I went to the other one, I feel like the edge had something and then I smeared it, that was the contact. So. I think it was because it was wrapped on my finger and I didn't feel it. So I go to another one, I stirred it and it, I felt it on my finger. So this one, it actually felt very comfortable. I like how it doesn't have any kind of ring around it. I'm going to zoom in real quick because I really love them. See, it doesn't have any kind of ring around it and it actually looks bluish. 
and grayish. I like how it looks really just like, I don't know, like I like it's bluish, it's grayish, it's not totally blue, it's not totally gray, it has that kind of, I don't know, like a mysterious kind of look into it. I really like them. I feel like these, you can pull it off even if you are dark hair and you don't have to wear heavy makeup like I do. Um, you can just wear like daily makeup and put them on, just like, I don't know, like people, a lot of people, they have darker hair but look brighter eyes, they look just so attractive. Think about Rihanna. Rihanna has so light eye color, but it's so pretty. So, yeah, I really like these. I feel like I love this one better than the last one, because the last one I still have see that little ring around it. And this one, you don't see any. It looks so natural. It looks like my own eyes. I love them. And okay, so those are the ones from, oop. So those are the ones from the blue case, and now I'm going for the green one. Look at the difference. Oh my god. Seriously. Look at the difference. I love the gray one so much. But if I look like a really, really edge, usually you can see a ring. I feel like even though I'm looking at the very end of my contact lenses, it doesn't have that little white ring around it. Oh my god, this looks so natural. This looks so natural. I'm not even, they, I'm not even getting paid, but these looks beautiful. Look at that. It's total white. You can't see it. Okay, now I'm at the darkest dark. So my eyes are actually a little bit darker than the average kind of Asian shade. So most of my friends, they are dark brown or light brown. None of them are actually black as black. My eyes, but actually it turns out black as black, but my hair, but hair isn't, which, which is very bothering me, but it's okay. And I'm going to open up the green one. I hope this green one looks really good on me because usually the green, it looks really good or really shitty. It looks like kind of fake. I hope it's not one of those fake ones so I don't waste my money because I paid all these. Oh my god, oh look at that. I don't even want to take that out. Look, it's so pretty. All right, I'm back. So currently I'm wearing the last pair which I have to say, I'm a little bit disappointed. The reason I'm gonna zoom in real quick so you can see it. So now you're a little close to my eyeball, you can see the blue ring around my eyes. Like in the center, I have to say, in the center, it looks really natural. I really like in the center. But when I look aside, what is this? What is the blue ring? So apparently I've so apparently I've been having some kind of trouble with these lenses. Um, let me tell you, I put on these lenses way way more difficult than the other two pair. I think the reason is because this pair is actually a lot larger than the last two pair, and by a lot I mean like 0.2 millimeter. So even though that's only a little bit, it still bothers me because my eyes are really small. Like I said. Um, so these are actually a little bit too big for me, and when I put them on, I don't I don't know why, but this pair gives me so much trouble. I took me so long to put on this one. This one it took me literally two seconds. I don't know. It might be because like I was really fluent with this side, but this side it took me a lot of time to put on, put them on. The first time I put them on, I put it on, it was really painful. I almost cried. So. I don't know what is happening, but now I feel comfortable, like I don't feel any kind of pain in my eyes. I can still see everything very clear, but I do see a little bit that light ring around my pupil. So when I see something, it's a little bit blurry or darker than what it's supposed to be. Um, I think the reason that I'm looking a little bit things, it might be because my pupils are like too big for this contact lenses. I don't I don't know why is it like that. Um, but technically, see, I'm facing the light. My pupil should be small enough to fit into this context. I don't know what is happening. This pair, it looks so beautiful in the box. I wish my eyes were a little bit bigger so they look perfectly on my eyes because it doesn't have the dark ring. It, it should be perfect if it fits, but it doesn't. So that's also one of the drawbacks of the, of the uh, website. 
that they don't tell you how big this is. These are until you receive the box. Um, yeah, so this is the last pair. I have to say my favorite among these three pairs is actually the second pair, the pair that I showed you a little bit earlier. I feel like those are more natural. Um, those have no... And like, um, if you look into um, the picture, it has a little zigzag around my pupil, so it looks really natural. It looks like what an eye, what an eye naturally supposed to be. This one, I like the color of them. They look really great, the color wise, but I don't think I will wear them a lot just because they're too big for my eyes. But I may do it or not. I may do it once in a while just for photo shoot. I'm still not gonna waste them. But the next time I'm ordering, I hope something I get is my size so I can fit them into my eyes. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I hope you give you some kind of information before you order any kind of contact lenses from the website. Um, and if you're interested in this makeup, where is it from? I have another video. Um, it should be in my channel. You can click on it if you haven't seen it. it it's on the way, all right? I promise it's on the way. Or that one could be earlier. I don't know yet. I, I haven't added anything yet. Um, so, yeah, if you're interested in this look, how I get it, how I successfully make my face look so reasonable, there's another video. You can click into it. It's very easy. Um, I... Most of stuff I use are drugstore, so if you're interested, please come to it. Uh, please click into it. And yeah, that's the end of this video. If you like this video, please leave me some thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, or leave a comment down below. I would really appreciate it. And see you next time. Bye!